One of the questions we recently received from one of our customers is, what if I want to print all of the detail sheets from my list view? Do I have to print each one individually? From this question, we figured it was time for a quick refresher course on the different print options. So what's the difference between using the print icon to print a detail sheet or a list of parcels versus generating a report from the report menu? To get started, let's run a search. For purposes of this exercise, I'm going to do a search in Sacramento County and I'm going to look for all parcels on Hewlett. After clicking view results, we see all of the parcels highlighted on the Google map along with the list view displayed below the map. Just above the list view and to the right, we see a green print icon. This print icon is perfect for quickly printing the entire list or for printing one detail sheet at a time. To print the list view, simply click the print icon. You'll notice that the Google map is printed on the first page and the list view is printed on the next page. To print the list without the map, you're going to want to click on hide map before clicking the green print icon. You'll now notice the Google map has disappeared and the only pages displayed for printing are the list view. So let's go ahead and show the map again. To print a specific detail sheet, I'll need to first open the detail sheet that I'm interested in. I can then click on the green print icon. And once again, you'll see the Google map on the first page and the detail page on the next page. To print the detail page without the map, you'll want to hide the map and then click on that green print icon. And you'll notice the Google map has disappeared and we're left with just that one detail sheet. So we're going to cancel that and I'm going to show the map again. Let's go back to our list view. In order to print the detail sheets associated with all of these parcels, you'll need to open each one individually before clicking on the print icon. There is, however, another option, and that involves generating a report from the report drop-down menu. There are three advantages to using this option. First, you can generate a multi-page PDF report of all of the detail sheets at once in your list view. Second, you can generate a multi-page PDF report that includes only certain parcels from your list. And third, the look and feel of the generated reports are much nicer and cleaner than those printed using the print icon. So just how do I generate a report? It's easy and I'll show you how. First, take notice of the fact that in our list view, we've got 10 parcels and each one has a check next to them. To print the detail pages of all 10 parcels, we're going to access the report menu at the top of the screen. You'll notice we've got four different report types available to us, but for purposes of this exercise, we're just going to focus on the detail sheet. Next, we're going to make sure that the detail report is checked, and then we're going to click Generate. ParcelQuest will then produce a multi-page PDF of the detail sheets for all 10 parcels that were selected in our list view. We can see at the top of the page that the report includes 10 pages, which are all 10 detail sheets. Notice also that the look and feel of the report is much cleaner than what's produced using the print icon. Now I'm going to show you how to print the detail sheets of only those parcels from my list that I've chosen to select. I'm going to deselect three parcels so that there are only seven remaining parcels. I'm then going to go back to the report menu, 
make sure that the detail report option is checked and then again click generate a multi-page PDF report is again created and this time you'll notice that only those seven sheets have been included in my report you can employ the exact same process when choosing to generate any of the other report types from the report menu. Thanks for watching.